The southern ramparts walk will lead you from Jaffa Gate to Dungate. Throughout, you will enjoy views of the city within and outside the walls. We start the tour in the southern corner of the Tower of David. Turn toward the wall to reach the entrance post. And climb the stairs to the ramparts walk itself. Here we will see the minaret built by the Ottomans, usually named the Tower of David. It has become an icon of Jerusalem. The flags fly on the top of a tower from the Crusaders' time. We can grasp how this fortress was built over different periods. The horses' stables belong to the police station, the Kishle. Standing on the wall enables us to view Western Jerusalem, which began to develop only 150 years ago. Looking through the loopholes gives us a sense of how guards defended the city. The tricolor flag stands in the Armenian quarter. In its monastery lives one of Jerusalem's most ancient communities. A glance from the dented defenses enables us to see the impressive wall. Also, a walk along the track wall makes a special experience. This corner of the wall is located next to Mount Zion and provides us with a spectacular view of Jerusalem. Outside the wall are located the cemeteries of Mount Zion and the beautiful Dormition Abbey. Continue to stroll the walls and reach a surprising sight. Just above the Zion Gate, enter the niche of a small balcony, the Meshikuli, that controls the entrance. Here you can overlook the Jewish quarter and see the dome of the Chorva Synagogue. Gaze outside the walls and enjoy the breathtaking view of the Kidron Valley and the Silwan neighborhood on its slopes. This is one of the highest sections of the wall, located next to the Tanner's Gate, that leads to the ancient Roman Byzantine street called the Secondary Cardo. It is located next to the Jerusalem Archaeological Park that surrounds the Southern Temple Mount. The southern ramparts reach the Dung Gate, the lowest of the old city gates. From here we continue to Absalom Observation Point that overlooks the Kidron Valley and Mount of Olives. It is located just outside the eastern wall. We finish the tour with the view of Absalom's memorial and other ancient tombs from the Second Temple period. Thank you for touring Jerusalem with us. We hope you will continue to enjoy your visit and the beauty of the city and its sights.